Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Roch for Alex AR. And uh, recently I've been experiencing some technical difficulties. My computer performance has gone downhill quite a bit since I swapped over to a, a new hard drive. Sorry, I'm trying to think and play games at the same time, which is not doing me any favours. There we go. I missed it. Duh. Yeah, so anyway, recently I scavenged uh, one terabyte hard drive from the scrap heap at work. And it's a one terabyte Western Digital Drive. Unfortunately, it was in the scrap heap for a reason. So, what I've finished up with is a hard drive that's bigger than the 500 gig one I had, but it also works badly. And that is just. Stuffing me up heaps at the moment. As you can see, I'm um, playing Keen 4 here. It's in a web browser. Some bright spark has decided to. Uh, put an in-browser version of DOSBox up and stuff sorry having trouble playing game and talking at the same time no yep so there will be a link to this in the description um, what was I talking about? yes Technical difficulties. Scored a one terabyte drive to replace my 500 gig drive. But it seems to be completely, well, not completely stuffed, but fairly stuffed. And it's negatively affecting my computer speed. I don't know how well this is going to capture but while I'm capturing the the audio is quite distorted actually no the audio is perfect but the MIDI audio is very very distorted and I'm getting intermittent slowdowns of the game Interesting how it fixes up when I drop the status box down. Yeah, no, I reckon that probably will capture. So yeah, anyway, the purpose of this video is just to be a little, little update video about the trouble I've been having with my computer. And uh, that's part of the reason why I haven't been making so many videos lately. And of course, there's always the usual flat out at work and can't be asked doing anything on the weekends thing as well. Oh god, that slowdown is horrific. If you were going to make a Commander Keen creepy pasta, you would slow down the. Um, the audio like it is here. That's just horrific. Shit! No! You motherfucker! Oh. 
Game fucked up on me. That's not necessarily bad though. Because even though I died, I got to keep my score, the ammo I've picked up, and um, the... Oh, let's slow down. Yes, I got... I died, but I got to keep the score, the ammo I picked up, and the life drops. So, that's not necessarily a bad thing. So what happened was I hit Alt Space, which jammed the game up. I'm not going to go underground this time. So yeah, this is pliable by capturing, but not very well. I've actually been holding off playing Commander Keen for a very, very long time because my mate Owen, aka Blood Spiller, is mad for the game. And I ever figured if I did a video with him, that's that'd be what we do. There will also be a link to his channel. Oh, that is just... Well, if I play Commander Keen with my mate Blood Spiller, it won't be with this weirdo in browser version, that's for sure. So yeah, you should always be able to get ammunition. If you blow five shots, this area will have the, um, the blaster available. No, I don't want that. There's a secret area below the edge of the level. So each side of the level has an exit. But there's also an impassable wall here. But if you do this just right, there is... secret area below the ship unless of course I'm confusing my Keen games and that was actually in Keen 6 which it could be it's a very strong possibility in fact now I know it was Keen 6 I know it was Keen 6 because of the hazard signage it has So yeah, I've stuffed this up. I'm in entirely the wrong game. And I've got the keyboard bug again. Fuck yeah. No, I fixed it. One thing that always gave me the irrits about this game was you can't re-enter a level once you've completed it except for going back to the ship. Um, got the 200th video special coming up soon. So if you want to um, give out ideas for that, that would be appreciated. Look at that. Little slug sitting there taking a nap. Ah, oh, that distorted music. Fucking oath, mate. Yeah, so if I ever do a video collab with Blood Spiller, it will not be using this version.
mad mushroom. I could never remember whether it was indestructible or if he just took a heap of shots. Don't think I can touch him at all. I think even if I hit him on top he'll he'll zap me. That was another thing I never really liked about the game was that most of the enemies are in insta kill. There's no sort of hit points, it's all insta death for lethal enemies. Except for rare instances where enemies will stun you. Which I don't actually think is a thing in Keen 4. I think you have to wait for 5 and 6 for that. Anyway. No, nope, he got me. Yeah, so once again, when you die, you get to keep the... Uh, the ammunition and the drops you've selected. See, this guy's friendly. He doesn't hurt you. And you can even catch a ride on top of him. If you can land in the right bloody spot. There you go. You motherfucker. I'm going to game over soon. So yeah, you can shoot down, you can shoot up, you can shoot down while jumping. And if the game was running normally, I could pull off some sick moves. But that's not going to happen now. Because the epic slowdown, it's it's not uncontrollable, it's very hard to control. Oh, you motherfucker. Well, that worked. That's interesting. Fuck, what was I talking about? Yes. Technical difficulties. So, yeah. Um, hard drive saved from the scrap bin, but it was in the scrap bin for a reason. It slowed my computer right down. If I'm going to play games, I've got to copy them to the SSD first. Otherwise, they're unplayable. Well, fuck you too. There we go. Ah, oh, those bloody... Those walking rocks used to creep me out as a child. You can kill them. If, um... When they're jumping, if you do the down shot, you can get them. That's the only way they're vulnerable. So, I'll just watch for the demo for a minute. And I'll keep talking. So, yeah. Anyway, tech difficulties, flat out at work... Brain dead from being tired. Can't talk and game at the same time. Just downloaded Open Broadcaster Studio. Um, I have been using the original Open Broadcaster, which I've had a lot of luck with. I'll be interested to see what the encoding quality on this is like and how big the file is. Uh, as I've discussed in a previous video, something I've done is switched from the X264 encoder to the NVIDIA NVNC coder, which is good because it's taking all the load off the CPU. Um, but the quality can go down pretty badly. It's a good encoder, but it's just got something about the encoding which makes the videos look really murky. Like you recording with a camera that's got Vaseline smeared on the lens and of course I'm very big on getting a good quality encode uh, I've also got a better internet connection finally I've gone from ADSL up to 
fiber to the node NBN. Uh, for you, for those of you not in Australia, that's going from an ADSL2 connection to a VDSL connection. And I'm now I've gone from getting 16 or 17 down and one to one and a half up to a good consistent uh, 20, 22 to 24 down and between two and four up so most importantly my upload speeds doubled or even tripled which is going to be hugely important for how long it takes me to upload videos of course these things are all between half a gig and two gigs so that's another little update um yeah again if you're interested in providing uh, suggestions for the 200th video special leave a comment hit us up on tw twitter or up on my facebook page all that sort of stuff so yeah that's it quick little update thank you very much for watching have a good one